click the bell icon to get latest videos from Ikeda. Hey friends, in the previous lecture we have discussed about phosphorus trichloride as well as phosphorus pentachloride and now in this topic we are going to talk about the preparation of oxy acids of phosphorus. So what are those? Let me talk about that in this topic. So friends, in this topic, we are going to talk about the oxy acids of phosphorus. So for that, we have few preparation related to the oxy acids of phosphorus. So for that, we have the starting one that is phosphonic acid. In this case, we are going to talk about that is hypophosphorus acid. And let us understand that is how it has been prepared. So talking about the reaction, so for that, we have to consider that is BaOH twice and we have to react it with that is phosphorus in presence of water. So therefore, the reaction that it will go, it will form that is BaH2PO2 twice along with that of phosphine that is pH 3 so this is basically a PPD that has been formed and now this PPD when on further treated with H2SO4 it will give us BaSO4 as a PPD while this is the product that has been formed and this is basically H3PO2 which is also known as hypophosphorus acid so this is one of the oxy acid of phosphorus that is I have mentioned about the preparation and now let us move on to the next one so the next reaction is the preparation of orthophosphorus acid that is H3PO3 so even that can be prepared by using that is P2O3 and we have to react it with water so as to get that is two moles of H3PO3 and this is known as orthophosphorus acid. So talking about the next one that is preparation of hypophosphoric acid. So in this case we have to consider phosphorus that is two moles of phosphorus we have to react it with NaClO2 along with that of water so therefore we could get Na2H2P2O6 along with that of that is two moles of HCl. And now this Na2H2P2O6 is passed through an ion exchanger where basically instead of Na there will be a replacement of hydrogen atom and that's the reason that we could get H4P2O6 that is known as hypophosphoric acid. So now let us talk about the next one. So the next is preparation of orthophosphoric acid. So in this case we have to consider P4O10 and we have to react it with water. So as to get that is 4 moles of H3PO4 that is phosphoric acid but in this case it is known as orthophosphoric acid. So related to the structure of those phosphoric acid I would talk about in my next lecture but for now let us understand the preparation. So for that we have the another one that is pyrophosphoric acid. So how we can prepare it? That is we have to consider that is H3PO4 and we have to decompose it. That is we have to basically we have to provide too much of heat. So in this case basically the product that is what we could get is H4P2O7 along with that of that is H2O. So therefore this is nothing but pyrophosphoric acid. But this pyrophosphoric acid when on further treatment with water it gives us that is again H3PO4. So this was the reaction or this were the preparations of the oxy acids of phosphorus and that's it. So thank you friends for watching this video. I hope you have understood that is how different oxy acids of phosphorus are being prepared and I hope I will see you next time. Till then don't forget to subscribe to channel. Thank you so much.